Hello guys, welcome back and this is Chief Chumai to our lesson number 3 the double interpolation using the scientific calculator last time we find the exact value of numbers by using double interpolation in 3 steps At this time guys, no need to compute a long process of calculation what we gonna do is just to input the figures in the calculator so the calculator I'm gonna use right now is a Casio FX-82MS but you can use any FX series guys or any scientific calculator as long that it has a linear regression features okay so let's start guys okay guys we are going to switch on the calculator okay switch on na siya so the advantage of this calculator guys because of its uh, linear regression features so that we can able to compute double interpolation by entering numbers here so how can we use that first of all we are going to press the mode and then we have regression number three so we have to press number three and then linear is in the bottom number one so we are going to press number one as you can see here guys at the screen uh, the rig is already appear so it means the uh, regression is already activated so we can use the features now as you can see in the screen guys we use the same figures as lesson number one so we are going to use this because we are going to find out if our answer by using this calculator is the same to our uh, manual calculation so first thing we are going to do is we are going to input ah we are going to interpolate three times also so we are going to interpolate here for three more of one meter and also two meters and after that if we can find the value of this these two we are going to interpolate also in this way so first of all we are going to input 0 0.7 0 0.7 and then comma we are going to input the value here for one meter is 39 decimal 7 and then press the memory plus <coughs> so meron na tayong isa then guys we are going to input 0 0.6 0 0.6 the same procedure comma and then input the value for one meter trim which is 3 4 decimal 576 okay and then memory plus yeah and guys so to obtain the value of 0 0.65 we are going to input 0 0.65 and then we have to press shift and then we have to press also the is var so this var is located at keypad number two then after that we have to scroll to find the y so y is in keypad so we have to press number two y so now appears 0 0.65 y which is we are going to find the value so to find the exact value of 0 0.65 is we have to press the equal button uh, the answer is 37 decimal 138 so the uh, value of 0 0.65 in one meter is 37 decimal 138 so meron na tayong value ng 0 0.65 sa one meter next steps so we are going to find the value of 0 0.65 in 2 meters so here so the same procedure but before guy we are going to all clear here 
So to, array, to erase the figures we entered in the first steps, we are going to press the shift and then clear and then start clear. Press number one and then press equal several times just to be sure that the figures we entered in the first step will be erased now we can proceed to our step 2 so we are going to enter 0 0.7 comma so the value of 0 0.7 here at 2 meters is 40 four zero decimal six six five eight so please memory plus meron na rin tayong isa and then here zero decimal six zero decimal six same comma and the value is three five decimal five three four three five decimal five three four and then press memory plus so the same we are going to find the value of 0 0.65 here so we have to press 0 0.65 in order to find the value of 0 0.65 we are going to press shift and then the same procedure is var press number 2 and find x so x we have to press number two again so so upper here is 0 0.65 y to find the value of 0 0.65 y is we are going to press equal k so the answer of 0 0.65 is 38.096 so the answer here is 38.096 that is the value of 065 for trim 2 meters ok guys and now we are going to find the, fal the final answer here 065 for 1.75 meters no need to interpolate here and no need to interpolate here because we are already here the value so we are going to find here as the third steps we are going to interpolate in this way so we are going to rotate here we are going to rotate this counterclockwise so that these figures the trim will be here so the trim will be our y-axis and this one here is our x-axis this way so we are going to interpolate in this way so first of all for our third steps we are going to enter two meters okay so the same procedure we are going to all clear shift then clear then we are going to press one start clear hmm? start clear then press equal several times to be sure that the number we entered in the second steps will be erased so here we are going to input 2.0 comma the figure here the value for 0 0.65 for 2.0 is 38 decimal 0 0.96 then press memory plus so next steps is next one is for the trim one meter so we are going to press 1.0 comma then the value here for 0 0.65 is 37.138 so press memory plus so in order to find the value of 0 0.65 here in 1.75 meters so we are going to enter this number which is 1.75 so we obtain to find the value we are going to press shift and then the same is this bar and then we find the y 
which is in number 2 press K number 2 so that's 1.75 to find the exact value is we are going to press the equal K so the answer is 378565 or the yeah, final answer is 37.5 seven so we are going to use three digits so the final answer guys is three seven eight five seven for the value of zero six five in uh, one point seventy five meters so this is the double interpolation behind but we have to interpolate this three times double interpolation because we are going to find the missing value here and the missing value also of this uh, sounding okay i that's all guys and i think that you learned something new from me and thank you very much don't forget to subscribe my channel this is your chief jumai at mabuhay kayong lahat see you on my next video and please share thank you very much mabuhay kayong lahat